Grace Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I might expose one. Let's crack into another one. TNT. Yo. Have you ever uh, left your credit card at a restaurant or a bar or something like that? I mean, yeah, I guess we all have. We've all been I've guilty. I've never done it, so don't speak for me. I mean, it's a common occurrence, though. So. Yeah. Have you personally ever done it? I feel like yes, but I can't attest to a specific occasion of when it happened. So okay, let's gotcha. just say let's just say yes for benefit of the doubt. Okay, so a uh, a woman uh, left her credit card. Typical. At, at, Jesus! <laughs> wow. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, women. I love you, women. Uh, went to eat at her favorite diner. All right. And left her credit card after she paid the bill. So, uh, the, the people in the restaurant, uh, knew her, I think. And they were like, damn, we really want to get Josephine's card back to her. So what they did was they took a picture of it and put it on their Facebook page and said, Josephine, come and get your card. Wow. But they didn't blur out any of the credit card information. Brother, they put her <laughs> shit on the internet with no information blurred out. So, by the time she came and got her card, <laughs> guess what happened? <laughs> she, her entire bank account was empty. Yeah, they ran up a bunch of charges on her shit. And like, Bro, that's insane. Like, So, I would have uh, contacted my lawyer. I mean, I think, I mean, it's... Nowadays, if shit... Nah. It, 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 fraud, man. If you get fraud, they pay that back. I mean, they pay it back, but nowadays people just contact their lawyer. Um, it's kind of sad because like the business is trying to do the right thing, but they're gonna get sued. You're gonna get sued. You're I mean, going to. If get she gets sued. the money back, what is it? What are they gonna sue for? Being stupid? Uh, yeah. But then they're gonna be like, yes. "What did you lose?" She'll be like, "Nothing." Uh, d- what do you call that? Pain and circum. What do you call that? Pain, pain and, and suffering. Pain and suffering. <clears throat> I couldn't. I get had my... to go through the trouble of going to get my information. I back. had to eat ramen for a week because I didn't have any money in my account. You know what's crazy, Jonas? Is what's that? that is that you don't put it past an individual to see a credit card number on on the internet and enter that in to make purchases. You don't put that past anybody, but you won't put past the fact that a person would sue you over putting their credit card online to do that. So the criminal completely sane, the person who actually has an argument insane. Yeah. Yeah. So I would like to say is that I'm not a litigious person. And I, I, I admit that the people in this story may not be a litigious person, but they have a case. And if they are smart, to a certain extent smart, the same way that anybody else is smart to take advantage of the system that is a, a before them, um, they would sue. I mean, people love to sue for everything nowadays. That's what I'm I, saying. Uh, That's what I'm saying. Nowadays, people sue. Have you ever found somebody's credit card out in the wild? No, Jonas, and nor would I use it if I found it. I'm I not have, that type I've, of individual. I've found a couple. <laughs> Joe, you're picking pockets. That's what we're doing. You're, you're just admitting your crimes. Um, and I have never used them. No, did you return them or what? Uh, it's not hard. You got well, the name on. One, them. uh, a man smashed into my parked vehicle in the street. Yikes! And he ran off. Yeah. After he did it. Hmm. And he dropped his credit card in the street. Brother, I would have just went to the mechanic and just like been like, here, use this card to fix my car. Yeah, no, I... Uh, and then you would have been brought up on charges. Man, I'm not I'm not committing fraud, yo. I'm good. Is that fraud? <clears throat> yes. Anytime you make monetary gains by illicit means, it's fraud. I mean, that, he kind of deserved it. If <laughs> I, if I, Look, honestly, if I was court, if I was the judge on this case... You win. You got it. I mean, based. I mean, you ain't wrong, but you know, I took the karma on that, um, and just I just uh, you know got rid of it. That's it. Got rid of I mean, it. what am I supposed to do with it? Uh, get his name, find out his, his information. Name was on it. Yeah. So you, I mean, you found him. Yeah, I found. Him, you know what I'm saying? No, I didn't do anything. You wait. Hold on. So. <sighs> Like my 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 anger's about to So you're telling me a guy hit your car, hit and run, he dropped a piece of evidence 
that not only linked him to the crime, but had his full name on it. Yeah. And at no point in time did you hand that information over. No, he came back. I didn't. Find- Why do I feel like you're bad at telling stories? <laughs> Why do I get this feeling? You jumped like you're just- in before I got to finish the story. I mean, you could just tell the story. Uh, tell it. He came back. I didn't find the card until after the whole situation was over. Like he ran off when he hit my car. He then came back, talked to the cop, blah 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 blah, and then when he left, I found his card on the ground. Uh, okay, I and everyone he hit your was car. like. You should do something with that card. And I'm like, I'm not doing that. Okay. Okay. See, yeah. See, now, see, that's, that, that changes the entirety of the story. I thought the guy hit your car, ran away, dropped his card. I'm like, bro, just take that card and go get your shit fixed. Now, it's a little different. I mean, so, he didn't yeah. have insurance anyway. I mean, I don't care about that. I don't know why that ad hominem attack. Because he wouldn't have been able to. He didn't pay for my shit regardless. Yeah. Just, well, who paid for your shit? My insurance company. Okay. So, it's, you're all good then, right? Except for me, my rates go up. I mean, my rates went up a lot from my car being stolen. By the way, I imagine from your car being from your car really, being stolen twice. What's really yeah. messed up though is that's a not at fault accident. That had zero fault in that. Yeah, but they assessed it as like okay, if they your car got pay me out a ton of money for my they, car, they had to pay you out. But it's also like the fact of like, all right, obviously you're living in a neighborhood where cars are getting stolen. You know? Yeah, it's not good. So now I have expensive insurance. If you're living in a gated community. Which I thought we Where were. Where murders don't happen. <laughs> <laughs> Call back. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I would say is that if a person hit my car and I found their card, I'm not going to use your card for anything. I Honestly, I don't know the type of individual that would. Like, I, I see how you could get away with that. I mean, you, yeah, I mean, you could just, I mean, Especially, nowadays, well, there's cameras everywhere, though. That's the thing. But if you're Indian, you could definitely get that off. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> What do you mean? What do you mean? I, I, I'm, all I'm doing is asking for clarification about your obviously stereotypical statement. That's not a stereotypical statement. I mean, if you're actually Indian, then like, you can like get that Like Native off. American? No, what the hell, man? Why would I say that about indigenous people? <laughs> like, I mean Indian as in from India. Why would that matter? You think I'm just going around here talking about na- Native Americans and calling them Indians? Like, what the hell, man? What do you think turn- I get off? I-, I love you turning this around on me. That's crazy. <laughs> how, would, how would a person from India get away with it? Because they live in India. They can get that off. Is that what happens? Yeah, they, it's how they get away with all like the like the scam calls and stuff because it's non extraditable or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I just look Cle- clear as day. Yeah. I've been watching a lot of Kit Boga. What the fuck is that? Oh, <laughs> I've been watching a lot of Kit Boga. What's your favorite Kit Boga? All of them, where he talks to Indian guys and they try to steal your money. Yeah, I love the ones where they're just like, "What are you doing? What are you doing?" And he's like. Nothing, and That's then like all of them. Then he gets access to like the, or like just deletes the files that he they need. Sure, That's... he gets access to their computer. <laughs> Those are. <laughs> that never happened, but it's fair. I like. It. I mean, I'm throwing out some stuff. You are no, but like seriously, like if you're in a different country and you see that shit, like, and it's it's not too far off that a lot of like you have like. You, you're familiar with, like, the South African print scheme where, like, the people, they're like, I'm in South Africa and I, you know, I have Oh, this. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm okay. a prince and I have a billion dollars. Exactly. Yeah. And there's the whole idea of, like, these, there's, like, entire, like, facilities dedicated to scamming people in the States. So it is it would be disingenuous for me to turn a blind eye to the fact that they have an eye on social media american social media so when i say is that if you're indian you can get that off all i'm saying is that they have an eye on american social media oh like they would media. steal the card and start using it immediately from exactly. india exactly that's I all i'm saying no that makes sense so if so. you're indian you can get that off you know how you prevent that don't leave your damn card at a restaurant <laughs> or if you're a restaurant, don't leak a person's information. You're gonna get sued. They just doxed her ass. On they it. literally they doxed her. Yeah, and sure. you're gonna get sued for that. Anyway. I would sue. Anyway, I would sue. Would you? Yes. All right. In today's in Why 2024, don't we leave your card I would at a sue. Restaurant, What's and that? then we'll leave your card at a restaurant on purpose. 
and and like and when you leave when they I'll wait there till they find it and I'll go you should just put it on Facebook and then like when they do it no idiot would do that <laughs> I, one idiot did it well, I've done that before and that's never been done I just went back and got my card <laughs> fair all right that's all time we have for this episode go to crazytown.com subscribe for Jonas TNT oh yeah.